This is a video demonstration of WordStream. WordStream is a keyword management solution that helps you get more out of your SEO and PPC campaigns. After watching this video tutorial, you will have the tools you need to get started using WordStream and drive more sales and leads, eliminate wasteful spending, and increase productivity and ROI. By focusing on the three phases of WordStream, discovering keywords, organizing keywords, and taking action, setting up and managing your WordStream account is well within your reach. The first time you log into your WordStream account, you'll be prompted to begin Phase 1, Discovering Keywords. This includes three important steps. Import historical data so WordStream can quickly get your account up and running. Set up a live feed of keyword analytics data. Finally, diversify your keyword data sources to help you discover more profitable keywords and gain an advantage over your competitors. If you are a Google Analytics user, you can actually complete these first two tasks in one single step. Just log in to Google Analytics and grant WordStream access. You'll also be prompted to link your Google AdWords account using the Google AdWords API. If you're not using Google Analytics, you can still do these two tasks in the Discover Keywords tab. There are three options for importing your data. You can copy and paste it, upload a file, or have WordStream scrape your log files. And you can set up your keyword stream using the WordStream tracker. Click to copy the JavaScript tracking code you will need to place in the footer of your site. This brings us to our third task in discovering keywords, diversifying your keyword sources. This will help you fully leverage your WordStream account. In addition to historical keyword data and keywords found via your keyword stream, you'll also want to add keyword suggestion tool keywords. Here you can brainstorm and research new topics to target. Competitor keywords. Simply enter a competitor's domain or the domain of a similar website you want to explore. Once you are satisfied with the size and diversity of your keyword database, you can move on to Phase 2, Organizing Keywords. WordStream makes it easy for you by automatically suggesting groups based on the keywords in your database. You can set up and manage your keyword groups in three easy steps. Form all of your main keyword groups first. Then go back and create smaller subgroups within each main group until they are very small and tightly related. Finally, once you're done grouping, you can set negatives. To create a group, just click the check mark to accept it and click the X to reject and have a new one suggested in its place. Use the suggested group properties info to help you make your decisions. Once you're done setting up your keyword groups, you can complete the third task in organizing keywords, finding negatives. WordStream has taken the grunt work out of setting negatives by grouping common modifiers, which reduces the number of keywords you have to review. The list of negative keyword contenders is sorted by frequency to help you prioritize the work you do. Start by reviewing the first 20 since these will have the greatest impact on your account. Negative contenders appear in blue and are shown in context to help you make your decision. To set a negative keyword, simply click No. If a negative contender is relevant and belongs in your keyword database, click Yes and it will be removed from your list of negative keyword contenders. If you aren't sure about a negative, click the magnifying glass to search the word in Google. You can easily change the match type of a negative by clicking the match type to edit. And you can add a negative outside your list of negative keyword contenders by clicking manually add negative keywords. Now that you have your keyword group structure created and negative set, you're ready to move on to phase three, taking action. If you're a PPC advertiser, you can easily transform your WordStream keyword groups into profitable ad groups. If you manage SEO content, WordStream makes it easy to create landing pages and apply keyword research to your strategy. Finally, use the Workflow tab to manage your PPC and SEO projects. To create an ad group, just right-click on the keyword group and select Create Google AdWords Ad Group for a selected group. This will bring you to the Create PPC Campaigns tab. Rename your ad group and choose your maximum bid. Then go to the Add Text tab to write your desired ad text. When you are done creating ad groups, launching your new ads is easy. Just click Post to post all of your changes to Google. Blue dots appear next to keyword groups with ad groups associated with them. SEO specialists can take action by using WordStream to manage content creation. Since WordStream supports multiple user profiles, you can use it to guide and keep track of the work being done by your SEO copywriters. Orange dots appear next to keyword groups with landing pages associated with them, which helps you keep track of your work. The Workflow tab helps you take action by seeing where work needs to be done. For PPC, you can identify keyword groups that are too big and need to be broken down into smaller subgroups, and those that need more negative set. For SEO, you can manage your content creation projects by seeing which keyword groups have been assigned landing pages. 
Once you've worked your way through phases one through three, it should be clear that keyword management is an ongoing process. Log in regularly to review new keywords brought in through your keyword stream and need to be grouped and reviewed for negatives. Quickly build out PPC campaigns for seasonal offerings and promotions, which often have very short turnaround times. Discover new SEO content ideas and leverage WordStream's conversion tracking, which can help you catch dips in conversions and act by doing keyword research, setting negatives, and other tasks that WordStream automates. Discover the WordStream Advantage. Visit wordstream.com slash try today.